Hey guys, RB back out on the road and it is a very wet Tuesday afternoon and yet again I am hand delivering a bike <clears throat> and the only reason for that is obviously I am picking one up so I am out on a ZSB, this is a Euro 4 ZSB and one that's been with us a while that customer has purchased this one and I am picking up his Keyway Superlight in part X so he's opted for the ZSB I absolutely love these ZSBs gorgeous bike absolutely spot on and it does exactly what it says on the tin goes from A to B now when these first come out these were around about 1690 they have gone up a little bit and they've gone up to 1990 now for the euro 5 version but i absolutely love these zsbs bolt upright position nice wide mirrors five speed box very very easy to see the gauges and uh, if you want to know how good the zsbs are ask jim um jim o'neill is on all the facebook pages absolutely raves about his zsb he absolutely loves riding it and he's also bought his bike from us he's done quite a few mods on it he's gone for a I think he's gone for a Denali light on the front of it now as well so he's looking at doing a few mods on it but Jim absolutely loves his ZSB and he's actually been on some rides when we've been out with the Beds Bucks and North Hans Advanced Motorcyclists but these ZSBs ride absolutely perfect, rock solid bike, built like a tank, bomb proof engine and you can't get much better than one of these ZSBs so obviously I am out on a ride, I'm going to deliver this to the customer, hand it over, do the paperwork which I have tucked down the front of very wet trousers at the moment in a plastic bag he has been absolutely hammering it down when I did phone the customer Paul and I said to him I said I'm on the way to hand deliver your bike have you bought a rain mac uh, don't worry about it if I get wet I get wet that is the fun of being a biker you don't worry about whether it's sunny it's raining it's absolutely teaming it down it's snow I tend to ride all year round and thank you very much car driver he's just splashed my leg uh, I've got very wet jeans now as well down in the shin department and that is the only thing with these Kevy jeans, they do soak up the water really, really badly. Right, slowing down for the corner, and that's a very great place to park. Right on the curb, half a dozen cars all parked on the curb. There isn't a kill for your fuel station around here, so why have you all parked on the damn curb? Great idea. Numpties. So, we are off to uh, a certain place, just up by the Wayman Safari Park, drop this bike off, I'm not going to say where the customer's address is, and obviously we'll cut the, uh, the video slightly short and then catch it on the way back when I'm on the Keyway Superlight. But we're going to do a handover, it's been ridden now for 21 miles, and absolutely love, as I say, absolutely love these uh, ZSBs. Quick clean of the camera, because I've got a feeling I've got water on the lens, there we go. But even pulling up the hills, fourth gear and it pulls loads of torque, as you'd expect from a little 125, never have an issue. But as I say, absolutely love these bikes. Now obviously the Euro 5, tighter emissions, it's got a um, cat in the exhaust, as all the Euro 5s have now to meet the emissions but it is still a damn good bike for under two grand so we've got a couple of ZSBs in at the moment I've got one of each colour but loads of Titans, loads of LXRs so if you are looking at 125 getting quick we are still selling bikes and we are selling them by the bucket load loads of Titans going out this week I've got an Echo going out tomorrow so yet again another ride test for me and a lot of people have been asking how is the shoulder? it's it's a little bit sore but it's bearable now it was I was in absolute agony a couple of weeks ago week in Wales has solved that problem but it's still a little bit sore if I ride an upright bike or if I'm on a sports bike I do get a little bit of ache in the shoulder 
and it's something I'm going to have to put up with, it's a sign of old age. But otherwise, all good, thank you very much. And obviously, uh, my mates were up earlier, we had uh, Grant, who's known as Rhythmic Biker, and obviously Michael, Uncle Red, they came up, picked up Kindle's bike, which was the LXS, and uh, while they were down at the fuel station, poor young lad, that couldn't get his back wheel unlocked on his bike, and it's running when the engine's running, but when I'm out to move it, don't know what that is, that is in for inspection later this week, so we shall see what happens with that bike. Obviously, uh, they helped him round, uh, put his back wheel on the Tesco trolley just to uh, get it round to us because the back wheel was just locked solid. It sounds something like differential on that, or something's locked up on the back end. But that's in for the bike team to look at Friday. We are almost at our destination. So, we're going to start to uh, wind the video up in a minute. Because we are only just down here. But, as I say, ZSB rides absolutely perfect. Very happy with the bike. Loads of pulling power. And then obviously once you've serviced them, these are absolutely beautiful. Good to go. Quick wipe of the things again. It is still raining. I am getting very, very wet here. Who cares? Anyway, we're going to uh, wrap up the video here see how we get on I'm gonna pick up the keyway super light and until the next time when we're on the way back guys I will see you all in a few a little longer than a few minutes later so second part of the journey we are heading back to the garage on the exchange bike and this one is Paul's old bike this is his keyway super light this is very very feet forward cruise style as you would expect and it ain't far off six o'clock in the evening so yet another RB delivery and collection and this one's done I think about 606 miles so 609 now but this one's going to come in have a PDI have a clean up and then obviously up for sale But nice leisurely drive back to the garage and <laughs> it was lovely and dry when I was doing the handover absolutely perfect and of course the weather's horrible again it's all gone Pete Tong it's all chucking it down again wet legs and with my legs in front of me I am slightly damp or moist should be the word But uh, obviously not far to go. And it's quite handy actually. And I'm just around the corner from home. I could have gone home tonight. Oh, got to get used to this as well. Because the indicators on these super lights are Harley. Well, exactly the same as the Harleys. Left and right indicators are at the bottom. Horn. So it's basically identical controls you'd find on a Harley Davidson. But it's not a Harley, it's Keyway. But it is a, it's a gorgeous little bike this. If you like feet forwards cruise style. And it ain't bad. I like it. So that's been picked up from Paul, heading back to the garage. And with a bit of luck I should be back just before the doors come down. Plenty of torque climbing a hill. Road holding on these absolutely lovely as you'd expect from a cruiser. So not far to go. And obviously I'm going to be going past my local shell, so I'm going to have a quick eyeball and <laughs> see if I've got any fuel. Got plenty in the bike, but uh, Hardly any in my little red picanto. So that's a, a case of a 
there's the nearest filling station and the petrol shortage still continues all those numpties out to <coughs> getting fuel topping up oh I can only fit five pound in my tank to get it full <coughs> but uh, yet again media hype idiocracy I'm waiting for the media to say oh beer's going to be in short demand everyone's going to go off to the pub then aren't they Or as I say, <laughs> condoms are in short demand at the moment because all the idiots are breeding. <clears throat> but uh, with me, I tend to say what I see. What I would say first is uh, ration everybody. Allow them 20 pound. Maximum fill 20 pound. That's all you're allowed to have. Then see how you get on. Let some other poor people uh, obviously get their fuel. And what about our emergency services vehicles like the ambulances, the police, the fire brigade? If they run out of fuel, you're all scuppered. That is just per personal opinion, but I tend to say what I see. Wish the council would fix them potholes. But seat on this is lovely and comfortable. And I reckon in about another 10 minutes we should be back at the garage. So, the lovely town of, uh, the village of Aspley guys. There's some gorgeous houses here and then obviously we're heading through Woven Sands where all the posh houses are a lovely sound of this engine and you can see all the posh cars are out today Chugging along absolutely perfectly. Do love this Keyway Superlight. So if you are into a Keyway Superlight, we now have one available. I'll be in with the team this week for a PDI inspection. Anything needed, quick service on it. And obviously shoot a video, get it up for sale. Clutch changes on this absolutely smooth as a bell. Beautiful, as Bernard Matthews would say. Thank you. Hence why you look at the junctions. Covered that front brake well. Yet again, more cornflake packet cereal license holders. He doesn't like the motorbike. What a shame. Road holding in the wet, absolutely perfect.
So we're going to start winding that up now. Final cut of the miles. Kill the video off here. As always, thanks for watching. Another hand delivered bike done by RB. It was good to see that it's uh, got there. Paul made me a cup of coffee as well. He was like, you're going to need this mate to warm up on the way back. Yeah. After a cup of coffee, I'm now busting for a wee wee. So as always, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget, thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. One bike gone, another bike on the way back to the garage. Comments down the bottom if you happen to own a ZSB. Go and check out uh, Jim Oji O'Neill. He's on the Facebook pages. Don't think he's got a YouTube channel, but uh, he's got loads of mods on his ZSB. Go and check that out. And as always, hit the notifications bell up the top. It tells you when the next video is coming up, which is going to be loads of them this week. And of course, uh, go and check out my friend Military Biker. He's just done the final part of Rolling Barrage. I should be watching that tonight. All for a good cause. PTSD in the forces. And loads of people have joined in on the rolling barrage. It's a bit like our ride to the wall. And of course, ride to the wall is this weekend. Unfortunately, I am working. I am not going to get out to make it. But uh, if you are out on the ride to the wall this uh, year, guys, have a good one. Ride safe. We're going to wind it up here. And it just leaves me to say, whatever you're doing this week in the horrible rainy weather, and clean the camera. There we go. Whatever you're doing, whether it's raining, dry, and you're out bike riding, have fun. Oh, God, that is windy as well. It is about to chuck it down. From RB, be well, ride safe, and it's a big goodbye from me.